Hey, welcome back. Okay, so I just came back from Walmart. I had to grab some things because I'm about to pack for Vegas. Yes. We leave next Monday, y'all. Eight days away. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I'm so ready. So I just got to get through this work week and vacation is on. So let me show y'all what I got. Let's see. I'll just go in random order. I got the boy some deodorant because he needed some more. So this two pack was on sale. Also got a two pack of toothpaste because we needed more of that so we'll take one with us I got this travel pack of q-tips for the boy because he needs some q-tips I got this big thing of lotion because we are all out of lotion but we're taking carry-ons this year so I also got these two little travel containers so I can pour some from here into these lotion Hopefully, that'll be enough for four days that we'll be in Vegas, but I know I can't take this big one on the airplane. Got some soap. We can pack that. I got some onion dip for the girl because she wanted some chips and dip, so she got some chips. Got a loaf of bread. The boy wanted some Doritos, so I got him some Doritos, and he wanted a snicker. I got some sour cream and onion chips for me and mister. I got Pepsis. I got this one because I was drinking in the car. And lastly, I got the boys some socks. These were nice. These are um, like for $4, these socks. He's been wanting some like, you know, crazy design socks. So they have these. So these are actually really nice. I'm going to have to go back and get him a bunch more for when the school starts. And that is all that I got. I actually didn't really have to get much for Vegas because I'm telling y'all, this year I'm trying to keep all our costs low. So that's why everybody's taking their own carry-on bag. Normally I pack, you know, me and Mr. Stuff in one big bag. And then the boy has a bag. But I don't want to pay because normally we take Southwest. But this year we're going on American... American Airlines or United? I think it's American. But they charge $25 a bag for, you know, to check your bag. So we're trying to avoid that this year. So everybody's going to take a carry-on. So we don't have to pay that $25. And, um, because we're only gone for four days. So we're leaving Monday and then we're leaving Vegas on Friday. So four days. Four nights, five days, basically. So, And it's going to be over 100 degrees all week next week in Vegas. So I'm not trying to pack a whole bunch of stuff anyway that I'm not going to wear. That's just going to be too heavy. So we are really balling on the budget this year, y'all, because this is the first for me that <laughs> we're taking these little carry-ons. Um, but we'll see. I'm not... I'm taking the bare minimum, seriously, because I'm not even trying to have a whole bunch of stuff. So now to figure out what to pack okay so this is the bag I have this is the medium size carry-on bag so if it does not fit in here it does not need to go that's my motive for this whole trip but I mean there's a decent decent amount of space in here and what I'm taking is not that crazy um, so we get there Monday evening, like 6.30 Vegas time, which would be 9.30 my time, so we'll probably still go out and find something to do once we check in. So what I'm, I'm trying to figure out, mostly what I'm taking is just some sundresses and then I have some shorts that I'll interchange if I want to wear some shorts, but standard black pair of shorts and then I have, uh, I have a pair of tights that I might wear if by chance we go out somewhere I'm like oh you know throw on some tights in the shirt and then I have um, I have a pair of black capris which could be worn you know more than once if I decide to wear them 
and then I have some just a couple shirts um, like some sleeveless shirts and I actually have another pair of black shorts so that's three different bottoms that I can interact interchange on some things um, but I probably won't even end up wearing all of those so I have my bathing suit so I have this one which is like a halter top and then it just has the the boy short type of bottoms and then I have this one that has the bottom with the skirts and I have another one another halter top which is like a mesh like a lace shall I say and that has the the bottoms too it has a little skirt so to make room I'm trying to roll like make everything as compact as possible and then I have a few sundresses I have four four sundresses that um, I'll probably just wear like afternoon nighttime when we go walk the strip go find some dinner or whatever and really that's it because for the most part I think we'll just be you know hanging out at the pool during the day I think it's going to be really hot so we'll be cooling off at the pool and then at night going out and seeing the sights and everything um and of course some underwear so I'm going to compact all of this as small as possible to fit in the bag and then I have ziploc bag that I'm going to put inside um got some soap so I, the big lotion that I showed I put in this small container so that should be enough I have uh, ibuprofen just in case my knee starts acting up from all the walking got some allergy pills because I already know changing climates my allergies are probably going to go crazy toothpaste like I'm just going to put all this in here that way if they go through it you know the TSA or whatever it's all right there and in case anything spilled then I have my um this is medicated ointment for my knee just in case it starts acting up and deodorant so all of that will go in here nice and compact and I'll probably just put it in the front zipper part of my suitcase so it'll all be right there so you want to see oh and then I have just something to sleep in got a pair of Mr. Zoe boxers and just a tank top um because we have two rooms my best friend's going as well so me and her are going to share a room and then mr and two boys are going to share a room so that is that and that's actually everything for my suitcase oh and then i've taken one pair of sneakers and my flip-flops and that's it um so let's see if i can get all this in here and be right back all right, so I got everything in here that I'm going to put in here. If it's not in here, oh well, I'm going to make it work. It's stuffed. <laughs> Can't fit nothing else in here. And then I put my Ziploc bag in this part right here. So that's, that's it. Okay, so I'm interrupting this video with a special mini giveaway surprise. Now, okay, so y'all know I'm going to Vegas. What I decided to do is I'm going to send some random people uh, postcards. So I'm going to buy a, a pack of stamps, which I think 20 stamps come in a book. I don't know. I hope it's only 20. So the first 20 people to send me an email saying that you would like a postcard from Las Vegas and send me your address in the email, 
you will win and when I get to Vegas I'm gonna find some really cute postcards and I will send you a little wish you were here note letter something I don't know um, and I will send them out from Las Vegas so if you want to get a postcard from me while I'm on vacation be one of the first 20 people to send me an email at ednabug75 at gmail.com I'll put it in the description box below I put it here across the screen send it to me don't comment on this video with your email ad with your address send it to my email email only the first 20 after that it will be cut off but yeah if you want a postcard send it to me don't forget ednabug75 at gmail.com good luck so my shoes wouldn't fit in the suitcase so right now I'm going to pack my carry-on my under the seat personal bag which is this so in the front there's like a little zipper part in the front so I put my flip-flops in there and then I'll just wear my sneakers to the airport so what I'm going to put in here I'm going to put my laptop before we leave so that way um, I can have it so I can transfer all my footage because yes I will be vlogging while we're in Vegas so then that way every night I can clear out my card and transfer the footage to my computer um, I probably won't upload while I'm there it just depends if what I'm doing in the morning if I'm not busy I might do it so laptop will go in the bag also y'all know I have to be organized so in here is all of our travel information um, my flight information our hotel information all that's here so put that in there and then um, I have a book for reading if I feel like reading on the plane it's a five hour five hour flight from here from Philly to Vegas so I might read or I might read you know while we're at the pool or whatever this is a new book I just got it a couple weeks ago I've been waiting to read it it's part of a series um, Eric Jerome Dickey my favorite author and it's a Gideon series this is book five I read all the other ones so I have that I'm gonna put in there I have a notepad because you know I have to be organized never know if I need to write something down I have a pen um, I have some Groupons that I've been getting for drinks and stuff and then y'all know I've been playing that game where I've earned reward points so when I use the points you know you get confirmation numbers and all that so I'll be using this to write it down I have my camera this is a camera that I use when I vlog um, it's pretty old I'm ready to upgrade this is the Nikon Coolpix um, it's but it's pretty like the lens thingy broke so this supposed to have like a cover but it broke but you know look it's me um it works for now but the quality of the camera isn't like what it used to be see so it kind of it's messed up but whatever then I have my little tripod that Mr. Gap for me so I'll be using this um I probably use this to vlog if I don't use my phone I don't have a whole lot of storage on my phone so I'm gonna need that for pictures and everything so I have this and then I have my um it takes the lithium battery, so I have an extra battery, and I have the charger, so I can charge the batteries. And I have this portable cell phone charger that I got from the Five Below store. This is really nice. You know, you charge it up, and then you can plug your phone in to this. I need to get another phone cord because the one I have, I just bought a new one, but it's really long. And this small one, you know, it's broken. So I actually want to get one of the little one inch ones that's like this long so that way I can just have this connect my phone while we're out so I don't have to worry about my phone dying. So I have that. have a pair of headphones just in case I want to listen to music or whatever. And then so I'm going to take this little purse with me just for um, you know keep my ID money and stuff like that in there what I carry but I also have a little meh um, backpack 
from Carnival. Um, so it's just a little, a little bag so I can toss stuff in, toss it on my back, so I don't have to worry about carrying a bunch of stuff while we're walking around. So I'm going to put that in there as well, so I have it. And just because there's really no room in the suitcase for it. And then, um, that's it for now. I shouldn't have to put anything else in this bag except for my laptop and the charger. Um, but we'll see, you know. When it's time to go, you always think of extra stuff. I might get like a bag of chips or some gum or candy just to have at the airport and on the airplane. And, um, there's another section here, so this actually has a lot of sections in it. So I can use it for little storage, even when we come back, if I buy some souvenirs or whatever. So, that is it. Hopefully, you enjoyed my Packing With Me video. Don't forget the special message that I left inside of this video. So, if you want to be a part of that, make sure you send me that email. Thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you next time. Bye.